And now, the starting lineup for the visiting Ventura Fusion. I recruited Jamie Bell to LMU. She was a player that I saw playing on a very bad club team. Um, and just happened, she was one of those players that I, I saw and thought was special and, and said, you know, I thought she could be a, definitely an Impact Division One athlete. She's one of those players that is, is always fun and always a challenge to coach because I think, uh, and this is something that's definitely different from the men's game than the women's game, but she's one of those players who has unbelievable natural ability and may not personally recognize it. Jamie Bell. I've always dreamed of playing professional soccer. Once I started, I knew I just loved it. I fell in love with the game. I fell in love with like make, meeting new people, and like I had really good coaches growing up. I just I was blessed from the time I started. Monday morning, the cake and this life away from me. When I play soccer, I feel soccer. That's all I'm thinking about. It's like constantly in my head, what is the next play I'm going to do? What is the next run I'm going to do? Who's going to give me the ball? How are we going to score? How are we going to win this game? Am I tired? It's just constantly something's going through my head about soccer. I absolutely love it. It's a lifestyle. And it's just such a great sport. Well, a goal of mine is always to be the best player that I can be, and I can always continue to grow and become better. And so, Michelle Myers, who's the assistant coach at LMU, uh, became the head coach of Ventura Fusion, and so I wanted to go play for her because I think she's an amazing coach, and she can help me grow and be the best player I can be. My name's Michelle Myers. I'm the assistant women's soccer coach at Loyola Marymount University. I've been working with the Division One college level for the past 12 years, as well as doing a lot of um, ODP, Olympic Development Program, with the Cal South organization. And the, just this past summer, I've just started working with the W League Women's Fusion Team. The Fusion is a W League team, which is a, a branch of the USL um, Soccer League. Um, it has been around for quite a while, but it's the kind of the first time it's been in this area. The W League is the closest thing to women's professional soccer. Right now the U.S. doesn't have a women's professional soccer league uh, because the WUSA went um, under. So this is the closest thing to, to being a professional soccer player for the female athletes. To be on the Ventura Fusion is it's awesome. You're playing at the highest level other than the national team. You're uh, playing with the best of the best. That's what I want to do. You have great coaches. You have great teammates. The players that we're specifically using this season were because the first year we're trying to get her name out there and trying to, you know, I'm trying to use the connections I have. My connections have been primarily with the college athletes, um, athletes that have both played for me either at LMU or have played for me in the past as ODP players here in uh, Southern California. There's players from Pepperdine, LMU, the goalie, Joslyn, and the forward, Katie Osborne. A couple players from USC, a player from Texas A&M, player from Texas. Um, there's a couple others all around, but it's a really well-rounded, quality, skilled team. Back down. Just kind of open your stride up a little bit and then back down. Ready, go. My name is Maytal Schwartz, and I am 25 years old, and I play on the Ventura Fusion. Growing up, that was my goal, to play professional soccer as an adult. And this is the closest thing to it at this point. My name is Jen Lilly. I played at Pepperdine University. I'm 32 years old. I am a stay-at-home mom. I play soccer on the side. 
once you get out of college, there's not much available for women. Um, so any any high level will interest me. And like I said, I've been playing soccer my whole life, and I love the opportunity to play at a higher level. The assistant coach of Interfusion is Brent Sarsfield, and he's the volunteer assistant at Loyola Marymount University. He's a pretty fun, awesome guy. Uh, I think the Ventura County Fusion is a great is a great opportunity for women uh, in sports, especially at the level that it's at. With the Pro League coming in next year, it's giving women and college athletes, and even some younger players who uh, have the ability at this point to join us, uh, the opportunity to get a higher level competition, challenge themselves with a higher level competition, um, and ultimately help grow the sport. Playing against the Pally Blues is probably one of the most nerve-wracking games I've ever played in because, in my opinion, they are the best team in the nation. They, well, besides the full national team, they are an extremely good, well-rounded team. So I was really, really nervous. I had big old butterflies in my stomach. And then, to top it off, I didn't start the game because I hadn't gone to practices before. So that kind of messed with my head a little bit, but I was like, you know, I need to suck it up, get over it, you're gonna ride the bench for the first half, get ready to play in the second. Second half comes, everyone's in the locker room and they tell me to go out and start warming up and I'm out there warming up and I'm like, oof. I'm nervous, man, I got the jitters, I'm shaking, I'm like, you know what, just go out and play. You know how to play this game, you know how to play it. Just go out and do what you do play the best that you can play, so I think that's what got me through it. Uh, the men's side of things has the luxury of they'll have houses for players or, you know, can fly in people for the whole summer and, and, and let them stay here, and again, it makes it a lot easier for those players to play. And some kids are driving from Mission Viejo, which is probably a two and a half hour drive. I myself is driving an hour and a half to every practice, so it's, it's a big commitment. If you want to call it a sacrifice, I sacrifice time and probably money because I could be working, but instead of playing, I believe that in life you should really go for your passion, and that's what I'm going for. I play for the love of the game. I absolutely love the sport. I've always dreamed of playing professional soccer. I would love to continue playing. It's just a question of, am I good enough? Jamie Bell has just got to believe in herself, and when she believes in herself, then uh, I, I know she can uh, be at the next level.